Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. On this, the first Shabbat that we have at seven o'clock here in our sanctuary, it's fitting that it's Shabbat Bereshi, when we begin again, when we begin again, the epic story of our people, the Torah. We'll start tonight, well, Judy. We'll begin with Oziva Zimratia, Vaihili Lishua. The psalmist wrote, my strength with the song of God will be my salvation. I feel like these words have never been more true. <laughs> Please sing along with us. Shabbat candles give light to all who behold them. So may we by our lives give light to all who behold us. As their brightness reminds us of the generations of Israel who have kindled light, so may we in our own day be among those who kindle light. The candle lighting prayer can be found on page two. on page five. Thank you. 
continue our service on page 20 as we welcome the Sabbath bride, Tlachado D. You may be seated. Spirit, as we turn to page 28 in preparation for the bar <laughs> Continue responsively at the bottom of page 33. Wisdom and wonder, passion and instruction, story and symbol. All these things your Torah gives to us. And the, and the more we devote ourselves to it, the more it grows and gives. What could be a true and Then this holiest of your works and the living language that gives it form, Baruch Ata Adonai. Oh, have a mo, Yisrael. Shema Yisrael.
together on page 36 as we continue with the Via Hafta. Via Hafta, Eid Adonai Elohecha, Bechol Levavcha Ubechol Navshecha, Ubechol Meodecha, Via Yu Advarim Ha'ele, Asher Anuchi Mitzavecha, Ayom alivavecha, veshinantam livanecha, vedibarta bam, veshitecha bavetecha, uvlechtecha baderech, uvshochbecha, uvkumecha, uksartam leot ayadecha, vehayulitotavot. Ein einecha, uchtav tam, amezuzot beitecha, uvisharecha, lemantis keru, vasitem et komets botai, vehitem kedoshim, leloheichem, ani adonai eloheichem, asher Tierchem, me eretz mitraim, lehiot lachem, lelohim, ani Adonai Elohechem. Who is like you, O God, among the gods that are worshipped? Who is like you, majestic in holiness, awesome in splendor, working wonders? Your children witnessed your sovereignty, the sea splitting before Moses and Miriam. This is our God, they cried. Adonai will reign forever and ever. Let there be love and understanding among us. Let peace and friendship be our shelter from life's storms. Adonai, help us to walk with good companions, to live with hope in our hearts and eternity in our thoughts, that we may lie down in peace and rise up waiting to do your will. Baruch ata Adonai, apore sukat shalom aleinu, balkol amo Yisrael, ve'al Yerushalayim. from 
Shabbat, by calling it a delight, will rejoice in your realm. The people that hallow Shabbat will delight in your goodness. For, being pleased with the seventh day, you hallowed it as the most precious of days, drawing our attention to the work of creation. away. There's a song on the wind and joy in the trees. Shabbat arrives in the world, scattering her song in the silence of the night. And eternity utters a day. Eternity utters a day. We rise according to our ability on page 46 for the Amidah. Adonai sifatai tiptach ufia giti hilatecha. Adonai open up my lips that my mouth may declare. 
declare your praise. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu, Elohe avutinu bimoteinu, Elohe Abraham, Elohe Yitzchak, Elohe Yaakov, Elohe Sarah, Elohe Rivka, Elohe Rachel, Elohe Leah, Ha El Hagadu Hagibor Bahanura, El El Yud, Gomel Chasadim Tovim, Vekonei Hakol, Vezocher Chasdei Avot Vimahot, Ume Vigeula Livnei Bnei Hem, Lemaan Shemo Biahava. Melech Ozer Umoshia Umagain, Baruch Ata Adonai, Magin Avraham, Bezrat Sarah. Atagi Bor Leolam Adonai, Mechaye Hako Atarav Lehoshia, Mashi Baruch Umorit Hagashem, Mechalkel Chayim Bechesed, Mechaye hako berachamim rabim, so mech noflim berofe holim, u matir asurim, u mekaye memunato, li shene afar, mi hamocha baal givurot, u midomelach, melech me mi. Adonai <laughs> You may be seated. <clears throat> when we behold your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and stars you set in place, what are we humans that you are mindful of us? We mortals that you take note of us. You made us little less than divine, adorned us with glory and majesty. You gave us dominion over your handiwork, laying the world at our feet. How majestic is your name throughout the earth. Baruch Ata Aronai, Atov Shimcha Ulcha Na'e Lehodot.
As now we turn our thoughts to those within our community and beyond our community who are in need of healing, whether it be healing of the body or healing of the mind or healing of the spirit, whether that being is close at hand or only reachable through the very long arms of our hearts. If you're joining us on Zoom tonight, I invite you to share that name in the chat or if you're here as my arm passes over you. Nisha Berach can be found on page 371. silently with the words you find on the page or those which you find in your heart.
Shabbat Shalom. It's so wonderful to see everyone tonight. We're glad that you are with us. Our Torah portion this week begins the reading of our Torah scrolls anew with the book of Genesis. And it starts with the word in the beginning and in Hebrew. Bereshit, uh, absolutely. And it's often translated as in the beginning. Um, uh, and, and we could, that's another sermon for another time. Uh, but the rabbis ask, why is it that the world was created? Why is the first word in the Torah a bet instead of an olive that is found at the beginning of the Hebrew alphabet? Some teach that the Letter bet is also the first letter in the word bracha or blessing. And the rabbis uh, teach that be, it's because God desired to create the world with the language of blessing. From its very first letter, the Torah teaches us to view the world with gratitude. Blessings are our way of appreciating all that surrounds us. In fact, those same rabbis challenged us to find 100 ways to offer blessings each and every day. Uh, those count the blessings we said this evening, those before and after meals, and for natural wonders as well. If we see the ocean, there's a blessing for that. Nishasad Hayam HaGadol, who has created the great seas, if we see a beautiful mountain peak, there's a blessing for that too. Shekacha Loba Olamo, whose world is filled with beauty. How about a rainbow? There's a blessing for that too. Zocher Habrit, Ne'eman Brito Bekayambe Amro, who remembers creation with the covenant. If we witness unusual animals or plants, there's a blessing for that too. There is even a special blessing that we say when fruit trees flower in the spring. If we haven't seen friends for a year, no joke in this time of pandemic, when we say the prayer, blessed is the one who revives the dead. The rabbis had a, a, a sense of humor, um, a little edge to them with that. Perhaps the most interesting blessing in my mind is the one that we recite when we see vast multitudes of people in one place. How overjoyed we will be to say that blessing once again. Uh, that blessing is blessed is the one who is the knower of secrets. Why the knower of secrets for seeing the multitude of people in one place? Because the rabbis teach not one single person in the entirety of the crowd is identical. Our faces are different, our minds are different, our hearts are different. Our individuality and our uniqueness is appreciated and noted as a blessing. Now there is another blessing that helps us get to that number of 100. It is one that's often used at this time of year, one we have spoken about throughout the holiday season. Uh, we say it the first time we shake the lulav and the etrog, um, when we say the, light the candles and say the kiddush for each entering holidays, when we dwell in the sukkah, that is the shehechianu. We even say shehechianu when we eat the first fruit uh, in the season. What's so interesting about that is that the first is often very far from the best. Think about the first apples of the season. They can be tart and not sweet. Think about the first shofar blast. It's not always the strongest. Sometimes it can be a little weak. We can go on and on. The first is not always the best. But what we learn about saying the shechachianu for those first moments is that we can still revel in the joy that comes with appreciating the gifts of the present. It also teaches us um, to have great hope, the great hope that accompanies new beginnings of all kinds. Our gratitude affirms our faith 
in the goodness of the future. We offer blessings for the first with the Shehechianu, and with that affirmation comes the hope and promise that the best is yet to come. This piece should sound a little bit familiar to you because we sang it throughout the high holidays. I invite you to join us whenever you feel comfortable enough to sing the song. Uh, it should sound a little bit familiar to you.
Continue on page 294 with the mourner's cottage. Yit gadal the yit kadash me rabba, be alma di barach yurit e vi amlich malchute, be chayachon of yomichon of chaye de chol beit Israel, bagala uvisman kari vimru amen. Yehe shme rabba me barach me olam olam me almaya. Vid Barach, Vid Tabach, Vid Pa'ar, Vid Romam, Vid Masse, Vid Hadar, Vid Alev, Vid Alal, Shemit, Kudusha, Brichu, Leila, Minko, Birchata, Vashirata, Tush Bechata, Venechamata, Dami, Randi, Alma, Vimru, Amin, Yehe, Shlama, Rabba, Min, Shemaya, Vechaim, Alinu, Veal, Kol Yisrael, Vimru, Amin, Moshe, Shalom, Vim, Romav, May the one who creates harmony on high comfort the bereaved among us. And we say together, Amen. Oh, Friday evening 
right here in the sanctuary at 7 p.m. We hope you will join us and eat Shabbat morning for either Torah study or Shabbat morning services at 9 a.m. Uh, in person. Uh, so please uh, come and be with us. And as we move through October, lots of uh, wonderful things going on, including mark your calendars, October 22nd, Rabbi Niemeyer's installation. So we hope especially you'll be here to celebrate with us. We're so pleased to have the quartet joining us after almost two years of being apart. Um, it's it's pretty thrilling to me anyway. I hope it is to you as that well. It's a Shahakiana moment. It is moment. definitely a Shahakiana moment. And Philip has been with us pretty much all the way, all the way through with B'nai Mitzvah. So thank you, everybody. We're gonna close with Yom Zel Yisrael by Bon Yashur on page 630. I'm sorry, 330 in the black page numbers, 330, and I hope you'll join us. <laughs> Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom.